So, my Rode Wireless Go came today. The little uh, receiver side, the little transmitter side. However, what do you do when your camera you're using doesn't have a mic jack, such as the Lumix LX10 I'm using now, or my DJI Osmo Pocket, and I don't have the mic adapter? Well, it's simple. You pair it up with a digital recorder, such as the Tascam DR-10L, the little tiny digital recorder. As a matter of fact, they clip together rather nicely and just plug the output of the receiver into the input of the recorder. That can be put in a pocket, that could be put anywhere you like. And my camera doesn't have a hot shoe mount, so I just leave it lying there and there's no wire. I did test the uh, Rode Wireless Go, which came today by the way, <coughs> with my lavalier mic that came with the DR-10L, the Tascam, and the sound is virtually identical, either indoors or outdoors. So that was great. So that's how you do it, and you just post-sync it up. Uh, in DaVinci Resolve, you just tell it to sync the two soundtracks by the waveform, or if you don't have that method, you can always clap and use that as a sync, or slate, or whatever. And uh, the sound now is 10 times better than it would be using the internal microphone of the camera. Hence the idea of the D, uh, of the wireless Go in the first place. It's a very nice little unit. Uh, it took a while to figure out what all the buttons mean because the directions, there are none that come with it other than none. And so you figure out the USB port, uh, you figure out what uh, how to turn it on, and then there's three volume levels you can record at and for me with my voice it records best at the lowest now i hate reviews and you know youtubers love to talk forever so i can ramble on for another 20 or 30 minutes but that's a quick uh, idea of the wireless go from rode attached to a tascam dr 10l and how it's used thanks for watching have a great day no Say you know that, yeah, you know that L word and the S word.